once you establish once you establish a relationship you could you can open up the door for so many other products and services too you know what i mean like yeah. if this works you know, you might be able to open up the door for other things you can offer the members or other products you can put through that distribution. That's one of the biggest things about distribution is that you could, the more products you can, services you could put through it, the more everybody wins. Putting yourself in the right, in the right circles of where your target audience is at. And then, um, and then also, man, I mean, rub elbows, man. Like all I, like, you know, when I say, you know, and I tell this to all of us, like, I, I'm going to definitely give you everything I got, but you know, it might, you might also need more things as well. Don't overwhelm yourselves. But you know, if you do need other things, you know, I'm open to it. I got a couple of coaches myself, but utilize it. Don't overwhelm. And then know what you're, know what you're getting from what you're in. You know what I'm saying? So like, if you, while you're there, obviously learn what they're saying, but also pay attention to the techniques, to pay attention to how they teach. Pay attention to the resource because they essentially they're doing the same thing you're doing. Essentially, they're really a competition when you really think about it, right? But but um the same thing that you're doing is the things that I did. Like I went through all my competitors' programs. Like I went through Tony Robbins, I went through I went through a lot of the different people's programs, like coaching programs, the Brenda Bouchards out there. I went through a lot of ET, Eric Thomas's, I went through a lot of different programs. So when I created my program, I knew what to do differently. I know what they're missing, I know what they're not doing. One of the reasons why I tell you one of my secrets, one of the reasons I'm so personable with you guys is that I know that if you go into somebody else's program, especially like at a high level, I know you're not really going to get that much FaceTime with them. You know what I'm saying? Like you're not really going to have conversations with them. So that's part of my differentiator, which is by the way, Joe, that'll also be your differentiator. When you see them, you're like, okay, well, these guys, they, the teaching is good. I like, I like, I like these things that they do, but these are also the things that I'm seeing that is, that's missing from this program. You know what I mean? Like, so I like that. You know what I'm saying? I, so also pay attention to, to what they're doing or oh, they're asking, they're actually doing it this way. You know what? They're actually doing it. As soon as you said it, the first thing that I thought that I thought to myself is like, damn, that's a good angle. Have everybody apply with an application and we only set few. And I, I mean, it's an angle, you know what I mean? But I like it though. I like it though, because it makes people feel more special. You know what I mean? So like pay attention to stuff like that because you can, you can easily incorporate that and you can, and that's how you differentiate yourself in a marketplace. By the way, we can do the same thing, right? You can have your coaching program, but you only have certain, you have certain add-ons or certain bonuses that you only do throughout the year. And you can, you, and when it hits that time of year, you can use that as the lead in, or you can use that as like the main, the main thing that you're offering. You feel what I'm saying? Like, I'm going to tell y'all a secret. It's funny you bring that up. So I don't know if y'all saw, but I've been talking a lot of, more about like we do Facebook ads now, right? We do like Facebook ads management. We have a Facebook ads management service. So if you want us to run your Facebook ads, that's what we do. But guess what? Facebook ads management is one aspect. You still come into the PCS program. So I actually have people who reach out to the Facebook ads management side of it and they still get access to PCS. You feel what I'm saying? And I have people who reached out to me for Facebook ads management, but they can't afford those services and they still go into PCS. You feel what I'm saying? So it's like, but it's, you feel what I'm saying? It's like two offers that's like one in the same, but I, I use one as, I can use the ads as a lead in and still give you everything you need over here. Because guess what? I can run your ads, but if you don't convert them, you're not, you're still not going to be happy. I could, you know, you can want to run ads, but if your program, if you don't have a program or a service to provide, you still going to be struggling. If, when we talk about getting clients, right? It's actually easier to get a handful of clients. Like when you, especially if you haven't, um, especially if you haven't tapped into your network yet, and this is not even a point. So I'm kind of, I'm just giving you context right now. Even if you haven't tapped into your network and things of that nature, like it's actually easier to do it when you're starting off. You know, one of the, you know, what's so crazy. And I remember seeing this during the summer, I went to an event and at this event, one of my peers, and I was going there really like to support him and, you know, and whatever. And we have even some of my, some of our members who went to this live event. So I'm at this event. And one of the things that, one of the things that he set up in the event, he said, everybody, we said, well, everybody's going to jump on a sales call right now. And he said, when I, when I he said, this is, we're really going to do this. He was like, he was telling his team, he was like, yo, lock the doors, right? He was like, like we, this is what we're going to do. Because people getting nervous now, fidgeting in their seat and all of that. We're like, oh my God, like, I don't want to do it. I got to make sales. I got to, I got to actually tell people what I have, right? So people were getting nervous. And um, 
And he said, when I said that to you, he said, we're really going to do it. But when I said that to you, what came to mind? And every and people started saying the objections. Oh, you know, I don't know what I don't know what I'm offering. I don't know. I don't know who my what my niche is. You know, I don't know what my price point is. Right. So everybody's saying these different things. He said, really? Making sales has a lot to do with your confidence. And he said, I'm a, he said, I'm, I want, I'm going to prove it to you. He said, you may not have everything tight. He said, yes, it'll help if you know some of those things. But he said, really, you don't need that to make sales. He said, it depends on other factors as well. He said, so this is what we're going to do. He said, I want everybody to take out your phone right now. And I want you to start calling people, call people in your pipeline, call people who were supposed to sign up and didn't, call people that you know, right? He was giving all of these examples. And he said, go, he gave everybody 15 minutes. At the end of the 15 minutes, he had a handful of people that made sales who've never made sales in their life, making thousands of dollars. People get $2,000 sales. Yo, I just made 800, right? And, but that really proved is exactly what he said, right? It proved exactly what he said is that like, you can help people. But when you, when you come through, when you're, when you come through with confidence, even if you don't have all of the details and you can't even say how many weeks you're going to work together, all of that stuff is actually, it, it helps. But really at the end of the day, if you have enough conviction and passion, and especially if you're talking to the right people, but even if, but even if that, if you have enough conviction and passion, that'll be enough to work with somebody and you can figure out the details later, which is the essence of why we're doing this challenge right now, Right. Because I want everybody to get their next client in the next seven days, whether you believe it or not. I don't care if you just joined yesterday. I don't care if you joined last week. Does not matter. Two weeks ago, you didn't finish the playbook. Doesn't matter. I'm, I want you, I want to prove it to you that you can you can get a paying client without having all of the details. But we need to create an irresistible executive offer. All right. So that's important. Now, why an irresistible executive offer? What's important about that? What's important about that is we need to make people an offer they can't refuse. Meaning, if you are charging a lot more than what you are currently having in your mind, what would that offer look like? So, so I want us to make this offer irresistible, right? So the offer, could, when I say irresistible, I mean they they literally have to do this because it's just so amazing. So... What that could look like is obviously, you know, if it's coaching, you're coaching them, right? But you might say they get one-on-one -on -one unlimited coaching, right? They could just, they can, they can call you anytime, an unlimited text message. If you need help anytime, I got you. It might be, you know, um, um, Leonard, Leonard set meal plans. Well, it's one thing to hand somebody a sheet of paper and say, oh, here's the meal plan. It's another thing. It's another thing to, it's another thing to, to, um, to prep the meals for them. You feel what I'm saying? Like, it's another thing to, you know, it's another thing to, um, order, you know, I think Instacart or some of these other services, I believe Instacart does it where they allow you to create carts for other people. You know what I'm saying? Like create a basket. Like you can literally go shopping for somebody else. Wouldn't that be dope if you was part of a program where, right, one of the things I know about coaching, and this is something for all of us, is that when people do it, they that's where they really get a strong sense of belief, right? Like, even before people join your coaching programs or even work with me, all of us, right, is that they have, they have the ability to know they do it, but they'll still have a little bit of doubt. And you don't, and, and you can overcome that doubt or people can really overcome that doubt from actually doing it. And this is what, and by the way, this is with all of us, right? What we have, the things that we have real conviction in, if you ever really noticed that about your life are the things that you've actually been able to do and to overcome. You really think about it. Like when you overcome, whether it's a bully, you know, whether it's, you know, I didn't, I didn't know I can, you know, leave this relationship. I didn't know I can make this type of money. You know how, you know how I, I thought it was damn near impossible to make six figures. I really used to feel like that. Like, yo, it's hard. Like it's hard to get clients. So nobody's going to work and work with me. Right. And it, it was, it felt, it felt like a, a insurmountable task. 
But once you actually start doing it and then you get clients under your belt or, you know, you, you're able to do the social media stuff or, you know, you actually see somebody's interested in your idea or interested in your program, you're like, yo, like you, you get a little bit of swagger back, right? You get a little, you get, you get a little bit of juice, a little peppy a step, right? Or all I need you to do is have confidence, present it with conviction and tell them what they're going to get and tell them the price. And let them respond. Just shut up and let them respond. And whatever they say, work out a deal with them. I'll give you extra time. Uh, whatever it is, work out a deal. You figure it out. We just came up with some ideas today, but you might have to bend this and flip it around to make sure that it's comfortable for them. All right? If you do this, what we went through today, you will have a new client in the next week. Guaranteed. And if anything happens that it doesn't then we'll work it out. But if you follow this, you will have a client in the next week.